This magnet game gone wrong. While never marketed directly toward children, the instantly popular Bucky Balls inevitably wound up in the hands of kids after launching in 2009. The CPSC forced a recall in 2012 after some 1,700 children visited the ER after ingesting the powerful magnets. These shoes were really cool, and also really dangerous. Pretty much anyone who's ever met a child, or walked anywhere, might break an ankle. Unfortunately, the manufacturers didn't realize that until multiple reports came in of injured children. This iconic Hasbro toy is still on the market, but about 1 million were recalled in 2007 after almost 250 reports of kids getting their fingers or hands stuck inside, with dozens of the incidents resulting in burns including one that required a partial finger amputation. The Easy Bake Oven now on the shelves has been redesigned significantly. As if that knocking noise wasn't annoying enough, this 70s novelty toy got taken off the market just a decade later for a major safety hazard. The acrylic balls would often crack or shatter in a tiny shard, that could then fly into your face. These flying fairies act more menacing than they look. Just pull the cord on the launcher and the princess doll spins up into the air and inevitably into people's faces. After 150 reports of eye injuries, scratched corneas, broken teeth, facial lacerations, and even a mild concussion, the Loop Toys grounded these playthings for good, recalling about 8.9 million of them in 2000. <laughs> Arrange small beads, spritz them with water, and your design will fuse together. Sounds fun, right? The problem with this 2007 toy was that the coating released the compound GHB, the date rape drug, when ingested. After three children went into comas after swallowing the toxic pieces, the Consumer Product Safety Commission recalled some 4.2 million kits. Remember these guys? Kids could feed the dolls plastic carrots and french fries, but get too close and the powerful mechanical jaws would chomp down on just about anything, including fingers and hair. Ultimately Mattel bit the bullet and offered a $40 refund to the some 500,000 potential victims of a feeding frenzy. Even with adult supervision, the flaming sparks shooting out of the breech end of the gun were unruly enough to scorch a user's wrist. The safety of the breech itself was yet another concern. If you were to Google the world's most dangerous toy, This is actually what will pop up on your screen. The Atomic Energy Lab Kit by AC Gilbert. It's because it comes with three sources of radiation and four uranium ores that are also radioactive. Science-based toys still win over parents today, but we guess this particular 60s chemistry kit wouldn't pass muster anymore. The Gilbert U-238 Atomic Energy Lab, from the inventor of the Erector set, actually contained four types of uranium ore. <laughs>